hey loves welcome back now in this video we're going to be doing another hair review hair tutorial and we're going to be working with curls queen you guys already know that when we're doing hair reviews or tutorials we like to show the entire unboxing experience and in this box you do get this brush this one is so gorgeous it's in rose gold and black you also get extra clip ins for the extensions as well and you get this drawstring hair bonnet to help secure and preserve the hair you also get this bag that you can use to store all these accessories and tools as well in this box again we have this pamphlet that kind of gives you instructions on how to take care of the hair how to return the hair and other details as well as a thank you card now this is why you're here this is the light yaki silk press clipping extension set from curls queen and look at the texture this is literally the same texture that you would get from my hair if i have like a silk press and this one is a light yaki silk press clipping extension set it's in the length 20 inches and i did get it in one bundle now in this bundle you do get two wefts with five clips two wefts with four clips two wefts with three clips and four wefts with two clips like you're seeing right here this is what the clips looks like i just want you guys to see what it looks like now this one is a seamless weft it's so easy to install but it gives that comfortable and seamless feel after installing these are the clips again on open it clip it onto your hair and close it now if you are someone who doesn't know how to install wigs this one is definitely something that you find easy to do and this is the texture of the hair now let's move on to installation now this is what my hair looks like i haven't silk pressed this guys my hair i'm trying to transition my hair so it's a little bit coarse basically so i'm just going to comb it through and get it ready for the installation process again whenever you're working with your hair you want to make sure that it is not free so that way you're able to maneuver and you know get the best installation process all right so now that i'm done with that i'm just going to start partitioning my hair i'm going to start sectioning the part that i want to add the clip ins to so i'm going to be taking this weft with three clips and i'm going to be using this for the back and again i'm kind of experienced with this so i know that this is going to be the best for the back of my head right you can go ahead to use two clips if you find that that works for you but this definitely works for me just open the clips hook it and then close it onto your hair make sure that it is secure and seamless you can go ahead to straighten your hair and press it you know get like a silk press before installing this that way it blends seamlessly but this is what it looks like i'm going to go ahead to partition you know section out the hair again so that way we can add more clips to it and i'm going to comb this through i'm also using the second pair of um three clips as well and i'm just hooking this at the back as well i want to make sure that the clips are aligned with the the way my head is shaped if that makes sense so i want it to flow seamlessly but also for it to look natural if i decide to pack it up and style it however i want now for this section i'm using four clips and i always try to start clipping from the middle and then clip the sides as well so that way it is symmetrical that is a hack that i will tell you to do and you'll see me doing this throughout now i'm starting off with the this is the middle part i like to call this sec like section the middle part i'm connecting the middle of my hair to the sides of my hair and for this part i'm going to go ahead to silk press it guys i wish i had done this before installing this hair but i'm just running my you know straightener through my hair just passing it through once i don't want it to be you know too silk pressed because again i do like that volume of natural hair now i'm using the five clips 
because again we do have a larger space to work with like i said i always start off by clipping from the middle so that way we get a symmetrical and even you know look and this is what it looks like right here so yeah i'm going to do the same thing again i'm going to section out um, another section that i'm going to be working with and take your time while doing this the lines do not need to be crisp it doesn't need to be um very straight just you do what works for you and again i'm running my my straightener through my hair i'm also using the five clips as well and like i said i'm going to start clipping from the middle just to show you guys i'm i'm opening up the clips and i'm starting from the middle clip that in and then clip the sides the left side and the right side and yeah basically that's what i do so that way it is always going to be symmetrical i'm just brushing this through so that way um you know i want to see what it looks like but i also want it to look good while i'm installing while i'm you know doing this whole process this is what it looks like right now you guys can see it is coming together it is blending the length is there uh yeah i'm just gonna add more clip-ins depending on what your preference you know what what you like the volume you want you can stop here but i want it to be full so i'm gonna be using the entire bundle so that way you guys can see exactly what the entire bundle looks like now i'm using the four clips the second four clips and i'm going to be attaching that to the section like so <laughs> and yeah we're almost done with this guys this literally it takes you a couple of minutes but because i had to like press my hair i had to you know straighten my hair it took me a bit longer so for the sides of my head i'm going to be working with the weft that has two clips and this is what it looks like you cannot miss it it's the weft the smallest weft i'm going to open that up and attach that to this section right here right now for the weft that has two piece we do we did get up it did come with four wefts with two clips right so i'm going to add two on one side and two on the other side so i'm going to add the second one over here as well so that way it falls beautifully again press this down so that way it matches with the silk press extension right so the second one i'm going to be adding that right here you do want to make sure that when your hair falls over it it doesn't show so you want to leave out enough of your natural hair so that way when you try to blend it down like i'm doing right now it's not going to show so that's perfect so i'm going to comb this through and you guys can see like this is already coming along it looks like my hair and the way i did it you can style it however you want to style it so i'm adding the third you know weft from the um weft that has two clips and yeah so the last weft is going on here the last two clip weft two clips weft is going on here and guys we literally use the entire bundle and this is what it looks like attaching that on here as well yep now when it comes to styling it is pretty much dependent on what your preferences are right but me i want everything to blend in so i'm just going to run my hot comb i'm going to run my straightener my hair straightener through my hair as well as through the clipping extensions as well so that way everything kind of blends seamlessly i'm also trying to get the roots of my hair like i said my hair is a little i do have a little bit of like like a new growth so i wanted to blend properly i'm also adding some serum to moisturize the hair to make it look healthy and brush that through right so it blends better okay so something i'm trying to do is i want to create like that curtain bang look but i'm going to be using my natural hair i do not want to cut this um clipping extensions even though i feel like i 
could i can but i'm gonna leave that for maybe another install so i'm just gonna curl my hair my natural hair i'm just going to like flip it a little bit so that way we get like that beautiful natural um curtain bang you can decide to skip the step and just get like the normal straight straightening ahead the normal way but i feel this would look beautiful and guys it did look at that look at that i feel like for my next install when i'm working with this clippings i'm going to trim the clippings so that way everything just falls beautifully but look at that beautiful you cannot tell me this is not my hair but this right here is the complete look what do you guys think about it look at the hair look at how it blends beautifully look at how it falls beautifully look at how it flows beautifully and this is the before and the after what do you guys think you can use this for weeks and you can take this out easily install this easily and it looks beautiful look at that you can style this however you want in the ponytail up back and it looks gorgeous right what do you guys think about this would you try this i'll leave all the details down in the description box be sure to check them out thank you curls queen for sponsoring this video and for sending me this gorgeous hair and i'll see you in the next one bye guys <laughs>